so when I was 10, I lived in a suburban neighborhood that had been carved out out of a forest. It was in a very rural county that was later turned to a suburban county. And this was at the beginning of that process. So a farmer's forest had been carved out in a subdivision built. And unlike most subdivisions, there was a wide variety of floor plans for houses. Some of them were very interesting houses with multi-story ceilings and all kind of weird balconies and stuff. But one of the houses in the neighborhood was lived in by what I was told was a rock group. Now, I didn't really think about it at the time, but I think that there may have been some kind of polycule or something. This was years before Morning Glory and Van Dorn polyamory. But one of the kids in the neighborhood made some sort of deal with them and he got hold of some of their records and sold them. And so I've got a couple of their records here. And unlike the Beatles, I'll bet they don't have a fleet of lawyers who will jump on me if I play them in their entirety on the internet. So, uh, so let's go over what, there's only four songs here. Bertha is based on the song Gloria, and it's a novelty song. And the other side of it, the pledge, is like a spoken, while they're playing music, song about the Pledge of Allegiance. Now the other one is Sunny Day, and it's an okay song. And Friend of Mine, which is a Christian rock song before I ever heard of such a thing. Now of these, Bertha was my favorite when I was 10. It was very funny to me when I was 10. I'm not sure how funny it will be to you now. But I'm going to play these on separate videos and so you'll have them.